Hi, welcome to Sanjeev Kapoor Khazana. I'm Rupa here. I'm again doing uh, the series of the coastal recipes. So let's do a Konkani Kadi, which is called as Jiriya Miriachi Kadi. It's got, as the name suggests, it's got cumin seeds, which is Jira, and Miri is peppercorn. It is normally given to a mother after the post delivery because it helps in the metabolic of her after the delivery. So let's go ahead and look at the ingredients. Some fresh grated coconut, bright red chilies, peppercorn, turmeric powder, cumin seeds or jira, ghee, salt to season, minced garlic and some tamarind paste, oil for cooking. Okay, so the procedure is that we have to just uh, roast the spices in ghee and then grind it along with the fresh coconut. So for that, take a tempering bowl, add the ghee, about a teaspoon. Once the ghee goes hot, add about 7 to 8 peppercorns, a teaspoon of cumin seeds. Let them start crackling, lower the flame. Take about 3 dried chilies, add it and let it just crackle for about hardly till it just changes its color. Shut the gas and keep it aside. As I said, you have to just grind this roasted spices along with the coconut. So take the coconut, it's about a cup of it. Add the roasted chilies, peppercorn and the cumin seeds. Add the tamarind paste, about half a teaspoon. Half a teaspoon of turmeric powder and salt for seasoning. Add water and grind it to a fine paste. Adjust the water, but the paste should be really fine. Yeah, it's ground to a nice fine paste. As you can see, the colors come amazing. So take a pot, add the ground, coconut and the spice mix. Just adjust the water. Let it come to a boil, then simmer and cook for about 4 to 5 minutes. Intermediately stir the kadi because the coconut tends to split when it's on simmer. Just see that you move the ladle intermediately. It's already cooking for about 4 to 5 minutes. Let a, some bubbles come on it, then we can shut the gas. The kadi is cooking for about 4 to 5 minutes. As I said, keep on moving the ladle intermediately so that the coconut doesn't split, otherwise tends to split. It's almost done. Now we have to temper it. So take it aside. Take the tempering bowl on the stove. Add oil. We are going to temper it with the minced garlic. We want the garlic to be dark brown in colour. So see that the oil goes really hot before you add the minced garlic to it. Yeah, the oil has gone hot. Take about a tablespoon of minced garlic and add to the oil and let it go really dark brown in colour. You can smell the garlic as it's getting brown in the oil. Yeah, the garlic has gone dark brown in colour. Shut the gas. Take a lid in your hand. We don't want that temper to lose its flavour. Let it go in the kadi. So just put the ladle and cover. Cover and keep for about some time, maybe half a minute till the flavour of the garlic gets infused well into the kadi. Lift it, give it a mix, put the pan back on the stove for a minute till you just mix it well and the garlic flavour gets incorporated well. Give it a stir and it's ready for serving. Shut the gas and let's take it for serving. You can just roast the chilli or just put a simple chilli for garnishing. The Jiriya Miriachi Kadi is ready. As the name suggests, it's got cumin and peppercorn for the flavour. And it's really very tasty. You can just have it with steamed rice. It's very close to a fish curry if you've noticed. But this is the vegetarian version of it. Hi, I'm 
am sure you like my cooking and my recipes. So please subscribe on the channel and stay connected with me. Happy cooking.